Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be talking about what programming language should you learn first. As someone who is a self-taught coder and then went to a coding bootcamp, I remember having these feelings of there is so many different programming languages out there. How am I ever going to decide which one is best for me to learn first and what is the most in demand? What will help me get a job? All these thoughts going through my head. So today I'm going to break it down for you. Some different things that help me figure out which programming language to learn first. But before we get there, make sure to hit that subscribe button for more tech and coding related content. Also shout out to some of you awesome subscribers here. Thanks for your support, your comments and questions. Make sure to leave in the comments other videos you want to see. Okay, let's get started. If you are watching this video, you've probably been Googling for a long time now, what is the best programming language to learn first? There's so many different languages out there that it can feel really overwhelming. And especially as to if you're wanting to learn a programming language for a specific reason, whether it be to land a job, build an app, build a website, different things like that. It's where do I start? You're investing a lot of your time into learning a programming language and you want to ensure that your time is well spent. You're investing it by learning the right programming language rather than just any programming language. There are some questions though that you need to ask that will really help identify as to what programming language is best to learn first. Because I want to be clear in saying not one programming language is better than another to learn first. It really is dependent on why you are learning the language. For example, if you are learning a programming language for the intent of building an iOS app or an Android app or a website, those are three different programming languages right there. Granted, of course, you could, there's always workarounds and makeshifts, but at the end of the day, it really depends on why you are learning this language. For example, if you are wanting to build your own iOS app, that will look a lot different than when you want to build an Android app. So how do you overall though decide what is best? First off, you need to decide on what the reason is that you are learning this programming language. And I'm going to walk you through different kind of scenarios, but that is the first question that you need to ask yourself. The next point I wanna make is to how to narrow down which programming language you should learn is kind of a tip that I used when I was learning my first programming language, which is go on different job postings and see what is required. Sounds kind of obvious, but you'll be surprised to how many people don't do this. So rather than me sitting here telling you this is the best programming language to learn, it, it would be so inaccurate because it depends where in the world you are. Different programming languages are more in demand than others. And I find the best thing to do is even if you're not ready to start the job hunting process, just go see what kind of is in demand. What are some of your dream roles, dream jobs, dream companies? What languages are they looking for? And then you'll start to see a trend. Right now I know the trend is a lot of JavaScript still, a lot of Python still, Java as well. And you'll start seeing, hey, you know, three out of five of these companies were all requesting Python. Maybe that should be the way I start going. So the example I just gave you is very specific to if you are learning a programming language for the reason of job hunting and the end goal landing a job, of course. But for example, if you are looking to build an iOS app, then of course learning Swift is the way to go. Or if you're building an Android app, then maybe doing Kotlin or Java is the way to go. So once again, it can really vary and it really depends on your circumstances. That being said though, I wanna talk a little bit about what programming language are best used for different things. The first one let's talk about is C++. This is ideal for managing resource heavy applications like web browsers, operating systems, desk apps, cloud computing, and even video games. It's used in a variety of industries such as VR, robotics, software development, and so much more. So this is a great programming language to learn, kind of overall overarching if you want to you know, get into the video game development world, software development world, all kind of encompassing, C++ is a great way to go. The next one is C Sharp. It is often the language of choice for game developers and mobile app creators, though it's also been implemented in enterprise software like IoT. If you're really interested in game design, this is a great way to go with C Sharp. The next one on the list, which is my personal favorite, which is JavaScript. A dynamic programming language, JavaScript is primarily used in web development to design interactive, user-friendly websites. 
It provides stylized web pages with added functionality and allows brands to increase their user engagement by displaying animated elements on their web page. It's also important to note with JavaScript, it can be used for front-end development and back-end development, which is another reason why I really love it. And the last one is Python. Python is getting a lot of recognition recently and is very popular. It's another general purpose programming language that has played an important role in data science, machine learning, and web development. Also, not to mention, Python's documentation covers how to visualize and compile large quantities of data using pandas and more. People have also used Python to program desk apps and many other things. It's a very versatile language. So as you can see, there is a ton to choose from and I'm just talking about a few here. So it really depends on the journey you're going on, what your purpose is. The biggest takeaway I hope you get from this is to ask yourself as to why you are learning a programming language. That being said though, if you are simply learning a programming language just because you want something new to learn or an interesting hobby to pick up, I think Python right now is a really great way to go. Going back to there's so many different tutorials, so much documentation on it that you really can't go wrong with it. At the end of the day though, part of being a developer is knowing what to Google and how to Google. So if you're wondering what programming language to still learn first, just get Googling. I hope this will help you navigate as to what programming language to learn first. There are so many out there that remember, just start Googling things and figuring out based on your own research what is best for you. With Google, that's something you're going to be doing throughout your programming journey, so you might as well start getting used to it now. I'd be interested to hear though, what is your favorite programming language and what is the programming language that if you're someone who's already learned one, you learned first? Let me know down in the comments. Thanks for watching this video. As always, make sure to hit that subscribe button for more tech and coding related content, and I will see you all soon. Thanks everyone.